Then we see a narration where Lin Feng, who is thinking, this is your Klitsch transmigration comic, a story about a modern world guy transmigrating to a parallel world, from being a trash to fighting monsters and leveling up, acting cool and mocking arrogant characters. In the end, on a tempestuous day, that trash defeats the demon king. I'm that trash from Earth, living at the lowest and poorest level of the planet. One day, while I was reading that novel, on my way to work, I got into an accident and died. Just like the prologue of every transmigration story. That's right, a transmigration story. I transmigrated. I transmigrated inside the world of that book and became one of the characters. The second son of the Lin family. The hope of humanity. Lin Zhao. That's not me. I am his useless little brother, Lin Feng. Hedonist and evil always living under the shadow of his older brother. This is the recollection I have of this character. However, all of this is going to change. Because, I am here. That was the story behind how Lin Feng came into this world. He then said to his father, Father, I know the map's location that records the ceiling item. Assign me a strong troop and allow me to retrieve it. Then he thought, since I was familiar with the novel's storyline and had an omniscient viewpoint, I knew the map's location that recorded the item that could seal the demonic tower. As such, I soon obtained the map that recorded the item that could seal the demonic tower. Then, in the Awakeners Association headquarters main hall, Lin Feng come here with his team and thought, although my brother Lin Zhao is dead, the real protagonist of this story is yet to appear. Now, it's time for me to save this world. I'll become this world's real hero. Then he said to one woman in his team, Zhao Ya, with me here, will definitely be able to obtain the sealing item. And she was like, hmm. While looking at her, Lin Feng thought, ice cold beauty. Li Ya, in my previous life, I couldn't even dare to dream about being close to such a charming beauty. But in this life, she's my fiance. Ha ha ha. And this lady that I encountered halfway. Wait a minute. Isn't this the woman our MC spared in the previous chapter? Anyway, looking at her Lin Feng thought, she's just like a rabbit, always frightened, always looking for me to save her. Then while petting her, he said to her, it's fine Tianqin, this is the headquarters, you're safe. And she was like, hum, thank you, brother Lin Feng. Then he thought, it feels comfortable getting along with this kind of airheaded beauty who thinks of nothing but romance. As expected, transmigrators really have a cheat life. Then he said to his team, All right, I have stuff to do, so I'll take my leave first. You guys can deal with the leftover matter. Then this red hair woman said, Eh, brother Lin Feng, where are you going? Then Lin Feng said, I'm going to find the great prophet and have a chat. Bye. Then he thought, Once I really become the hero who sealed the demonic tower, won't I be able to get whatever I want? Who cares about a few women? Then that other woman from Lin Feng's team went to the receptionist and said, Hello, we're here to transact service. Then the receptionist asked, All right, what kind of service do you want? Then that woman said, I want to recommend a person to join the association. Then the receptionist asked, I know. Who may you be recommending? Then she said, The one I want to recommend is her. Her name is Li Tianqin. She was saved by Lin Feng and me when we were exploring a dungeon. And that red hair woman was like, Hello. Then that woman said, She's the only person who has seen the Demon King and survived. Allow her to join the association. Hearing that, the receptionist become shocked and was like, Demon King? Then that red hair woman said, That's right. Do you know Senior by King Feng? He is a pretty well-known hidden genius. I'm his only follower, Senior, and I encountered the Demon King in the dungeon. The Demon King killed Senior, but I somehow managed to escape. Later on, came across Sir Lin Feng and Miss Li Ya, and joined their team. Hearing that, the receptionist said, Huh? By King Feng. He just joined the association, and is well and alive. And that red hair woman was like, What? Then the receptionist said, he was here a while ago, when he said that he's going to visit the great prophet. Hearing that, both of these women were like, Did you just say, Bai King Feng is still alive? And then we see our main character, the demon king. He was still holding this old man in the air by the throat. Then MC asked him, 
have you divined your ending tonight? And this old man was like, er, no, don't kill me, I beg you, Lord Demon King, please spare me, I am willing to work under you, you can ask me to do anything, I am still useful to you, no, please don't kill me. What happened to his speech about saving the world before? What a hypocrite and pathetic perverted bastard. Then MC said, T.S.K. Is this the only thing you can say? How boring. I used to think that all humans are just like Lin Zhao. Full of courage, justice, and strength. But it seems like I'm still unfamiliar with humanity. I must improve my knowledge about my enemies. To think I would find an existence like you among humans. The concern in my heart has been greatly reduced. In appreciation of your performance, I'll send you away. And with that, MC killed this old bastard. Well, if you ask me, I am pretty satisfied with this old man's death. Then MC come out from this old man's room. While coming out, MC thought, if I return to the demonic tower. And Lin Feng obtains the sealing item. Just as the prophecy said, I will forever be trapped within the demonic tower. On the other hand, if I go to prevent Lin Feng, not only might I fail, but I might also get killed by a hero, just like the divination stated. What do I do? No matter what, it's still too risky for me to leave the demonic tower. Since I've gotten the content of the prophecy, I shall return to the demonic tower first. Maybe later on, I'll be able to find a way to get rid of the prophecy. Then MC said, I remember. There's a back door here. Then suddenly, someone touched his shoulder. It was Lin Feng. He said, who are you? Why have I never seen you before? Seeing this, MC was like, shit, I was discovered. But MC didn't lose his cool and said to him, ah, I'm an awakener who recently joined the association. Do you need something? Hearing that, Lin Feng was like, huh? You? Your badge is certainly something only an S rank awakener can have. Are you really that strong? How about joining my team? We're going to retrieve the item that can seal the demonic tower. Hearing that, MC was like, Sealing item? Then Lin Feng said, I'm Lin Feng. You might not have heard of my name before, but I am soon going to be known throughout the world. You look talented. How about you join my team? And MC was like, Lin Feng, you say? Sure. Then MC thought, Great prophet. Let's see whether your prophecy turns out to be true. The fish come on its own to get chopped, so who can be blamed? Ha ha ha. Well, with that, this video is finished. Thank you for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe to my channel for more entertaining videos like this.